Hello, fellow gamers and YouTubers alike. This is Midnight Gamer here with my first ever, well, actually, now it's my second video because I did upload one already, but my first ever gameplay episode ever on this channel. Um, I am very new to YouTube. Well, not very, that doesn't make sense. I'm not very new to YouTube because I used YouTube like my entire life. But I'm very new to the whole having my own channel, being on YouTube, uploading videos, doing that kind of stuff. So, I am here with The Witcher Enhanced Edition from Steam. Um, you guys probably already know about it if you guys are keeping up with the Steam sale because it was on sale for a very cheap price. I had to get it. And the thing is, I've never played The Witcher series um, and I've never really known what they were about, but I found out, you know, it's an RPG type game. And after the E3 trailer, if you guys um, are keeping up with all that gaming kind of stuff, after the E3, um, the trailer that they showed at E3, I was literally blown away. Like, I cannot wait until The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt comes out. But I was like, well, you know, I'm kind of one of those people where I don't like playing new games unless I've played um, previous ones. So here I am playing the first Witcher. Um, without further ado, I think I'm going to go ahead and get started right here in just a second. So, let me get situated, and then um, I'll go ahead and be back in just a moment. Alrighty, guys, so here we go. We're going to go ahead and start a new game. I did play um, the first few minutes of it just to kind of get a feel of um, how many cutscenes and whatnot there are, and there are quite a few at the beginning, so I'm going to go ahead and let you guys watch the cutscenes. I don't want to cut through them, and um, so I won't talk through any cutscenes. You guys can go ahead and enjoy those, and then enjoy the gameplay as well. So thank you guys for watching, and here we go. We'll go ahead and play as the Witcher. I'll probably do new adventures later on after I play the game, and medium difficulty, and keyboard and mouse controlled. So here we go. Well, that was an awkward silence. I didn't really realize that there was going to be a little loading scene right here. So, um, I think there is a cutscene right at the beginning, so I'll go ahead and stop talking, whether I cut myself off or not, right when it gets there. But, um, just a little bit about me. I've been playing since my first video. I've been playing games since... Alright, here it is. <laughs> the Northern Kingdoms nursed their wounds for five years after the Great War. Plague and famine raged, the death toll unknown. A few surviving elven and dwarven units sought refuge amidst forests, where they prepared for a final, desperate fight. Abominable beasts ruled backwoods, highways, and former battlefields alike. In cities and villages, folk were left wondering what had happened to the Witchers. The Blue Mountains in the north of Kedwin, the year 1270. Five years after the Great War. Everything's all right. I have no idea where you've been. The important thing is you're alive and among friends. Though you look like you just left your grave.
You'll speak soon enough. We're nearing Kaer Morin. Tris. Your time nears its end, witches. Enjoy things while you can. Wrong! You missed the parry! I keep repeating this. Pirouette always followed by a back cross parry. Always! Barely two days have passed since they found you. Mm-hmm. I owe my recovery to you. Thank you, Triss. Remember anything? Not much. Look below. I know the moves. Pirouette. Parry. Cut. Explain it, but I feel a bond when we speak. I know you are important. Geralt, we. <gasps> I need to think. Time flows slowly at Kermoran. It worked! Not bad. Take a rest. What do you think, Geralt? Is he ready for the path? Wait for the rest. He's alone. The Professor promised 50 orange for every freak we kill. He's uh. mine! Vesemir! We got company! I'm shutting the gate! Geralt, grab a sword off the training forms! So I gotta go in and grab that sword. And yeah, see that so that professor guy, that creepy guy, I knew he was gonna be bad news. Let me turn down the volume just a little bit. Um I'll click an enemy to attack. Alright, come on, bro. Come at me. Let's go. There we go. So why can't I use those powers yet? I don't wanna do that. That guy just like shot a shockwave at them. That was nice, I want that. Oh, he's getting me. Okay, there we go. So, it's kind of cool, actually. I like the, the combat. It's actually kind of cool. It's like a... You, you just press once to attack. And then when you want to attack again, you just hit again. So, pretty simple. Pretty nice. I'm sure I'll have more moves later on. How do you feel? Fine. Anyone know who the intruders are? Ordinary bandits would never attack Kaer Morin. 
That we know, Marigold. You could try some of your famous magic. In due time, Lambert. Enough! We need to check the other possible passages to the upper courtyard. Alright, so let's follow them up to the upper courtyard. Yeah, see, so it was that weird it was that weird guy, he was like, Your time is coming to an end, Witchers. I think he hired those guys. Because they said the professor promised us fifty orins, so it was probably him. Horrible person too. Why would he want to kill us? What's happening? They're trying to break down the gate! They won't get anywhere without a battering ram. Shit! What is that? A frightener. One mean beast. Savola. I know him. A mage as ambitious as he is insane. They're coming up here. Get ready! There's more! They're entering the upper courtyard! The one in glasses is the professor. Murder for hire. I sense magic. There's a sorcerer among them. Professor, you know the way. Get to it. The Professor is wanted in Redania, Tamaria, and Kedwin. A real maggot. I don't recognize the Sorcerer. Marigold, I'm interested in whether you can disarm Savola. The rest is witch's work. I'll try. They're coming. The Frightener is very dangerous, but it's vulnerable to loud noises. The bell's in the upper courtyard. Exactly. Eskel, Lambert, you'll help me stop the Frightener and the bandits. Leo, stay behind us. Geralt, you open the gate to the upper courtyard. When we're there, Triss can stop Savola and his pet while we prepare to deal with the Professor and the Unknown Mage. I'll figure something out. Let's do this. Bleed them a bit down here before withdrawing. Geralt, follow the wall and break through to the tower where there's a passage to the upper courtyard. Alone? They're just bandits, though one might be infamous. You must open the gate. We'll be waiting. Good luck, Wolf. They're definitely putting a lot of trust into me after I just recovered. Okay, so we got like a little map now. Oh no. Hold on, let me take care of this guy real fast. Yeah, so it's kind of horrible. Oh, chain attacks, yay. Messed up that chain attack. Anyway, so they got a mage, a giant beast, a crazed professor, and a sorcerer on their side. And all these bandits. And there's like maybe a couple of us. Oh, that was real nice. So when you stun him, you have like a little finish off attack, because I'm pretty sure I just like slit his neck in that moment. That was pretty nice. So yeah, they got a they got a lot of people on their side, and there's only a few of us witchers. How are we supposed to win? I don't I don't get that at all. They think that we're gonna win. Um so no, not that way. We gotta go this way, right? Oh no. What was he trying to do over there with the barrel? You'll regret the day you were born. Trying to set some some explosives to blow us up. That's not very nice. This is my place, bro. I'm gonna have to, gonna have to kill you. Sorry. Put away my sword. Oh god, it's like every time I put away my sword, there's more of them. So yeah, it's actually kind of funny. First impressions of the game so far. I mean, not necessarily first. I've been watching for a while now, but. The graphics for 2007 are pretty great, actually. I really am liking them. And I guess we'll see how uh, how the game plays out as we progress. Gameplay, whatever gets better, maybe, you know? Fast style to defeat agile opponents. 
So we're gonna take our sword out and then press X. There we go. So what, this is like a fast, oh yeah, that's nice and fast. Strong style is the normal one, so let's go back to Z for this guy apparently. So wow, this is like I'm just such an awesome person. Like nobody can nobody can fight me. I win. I just win at everything. I'm such a such a good fighter. Oh that's cool. So you can do pause mode. So that way you can, whoops, I don't know what I'm doing, Never mind. don't do that again. That was a bad idea, I'll figure it out later, because <laughs> I almost died because of that. Come on, flaming sword, we gotta get these guys. And back to Z, click Z again, back to strong mode. This guy, so I can get him. Ah, I missed. You gotta hit that flaming sword right at the right moment or you just kinda kinda fail. Alright, so yeah, first impressions of the game. Pretty nice looking for 2007 to be honest. So far the cutscenes are showing a really nice story. I, I really do like it. Oh god, there's so many of them, run! No way through here. Follow me. Back to Savola. Alrighty then. So, was anybody going to warn me that this, this staircase was totally going to collapse on me? Oh god. Or that there was going to be a guy standing here ready to kill me? But yeah, they were like, hey, go up the staircase and open the gate for us. They didn't even tell me that it's just going to, you know, fall apart on me. Is this... Is this all they were talking about in the upper courtyard? Do I got to press this? Or... I don't know. Let's see. Hey, okay, I'm ringing it. Maybe that'll help them because of that frightener guy, the beast. Ah! God, this attack mode is so complicated. So I gotta figure out. I gotta be able to press X really fast. I gotta, I gotta figure that out better because I'm not gonna get anywhere if I'm trying to press X and fight at the same time. And Ah, I'm getting attacked by two people. This isn't nice. I'm gonna regret the day I was born. Are you sure about that? Cause I think I just, I just, I just beat you. I'm sorry to say, but you know I won. So that's kind of how it works nowadays. Oh, there's another one over here. Switch back to fast mode because he's like one of those. But he's also an archer. I wonder if I get a bow later on. I love bows. I want a bow. Somebody better give me a bow. I want my bow. Give me your bow. Where's the bow? Need it. Oh. I can actually loot from that. That's cool. I didn't. I didn't know that. I should. I should go back up here. They all have just like some some alcohol. Oh, the other one just kind of disappeared. So he obviously had nothing in his body. <laughs> Alright, let's go down here. Because even his bones weren't there. That was very odd. Oh. Alright, well, I guess we will be back, guys, because. <laughs> major issue here, apparently. Alright, hey, guys, and we are back. I'm sorry, I had, like, a. Like, a problem with Witcher, so I actually had to restart and get back to this point. That's why it looks a little bit different. That guy wasn't in the same spot. But yeah, I had to go all the way back. It was kind of bad. But I did get a bun from one of them. One of the two guys up there. So anyway, we are back at the basically the exact same point. So I figured it wouldn't be a problem. Um, we'll go ahead and continue here. I don't know what the problem was. Why it quit on me like that. 
making me mad. I'm going to figure that out later. But um, we were on our way to open the gate, so let's, let's hope we can do that without any more technical errors. And finish him. Oh, that was... Wow, I'm pretty sure I would have cut off his head if that really happened. Don't you dare attack me from behind. Okay, I don't appreciate it. So now we're learning how to open the gate. Okay then. Can't be that hard, can it? There we go. <laughs> it wasn't that hard. Figured it out. It's a miracle you're alive. You could have told me about the stairs. Lambert and Eskel were supposed to fix them yesterday. We're not Masons. No matter. The Professor and the other mage must be hiding in the keep. Face the truth, Witchers. They're here to rob you. Trace, child, we have nothing of value. Some good steel, snow fox pelts. I mean the laboratory and you know it. Someone wants your famed mutagens. You're jumping to conclusions. Truce may be right. We need to find out what they want. One thing at a time. We shouldn't turn our backs on a strong mage leading a frightener. And you can't let the bandits in the lab. Right as usual, Triss. Geralt, you've dealt with mages. Find out what this one wants. Leo will guide you. Just reconnaissance, or...? No one will be sorry if some of them lose their heads. You'll manage, Wolf. Just remember Leo's with you. I can handle this. We'll see what's happening inside and be back. Take these potions just in case. Drink the Thunderbolt now and keep Swallow for when you need healing. I'll be able to tell you how they work. We'll make sure no one else gets inside. Triss, stay with us in case Savola has any new ideas. Thunderbolt potion. Are we allowed to uh, throw Thunderbolts after we drink it? That would be great. Increases damage inflict on opponents. Oh no, it's not for that at all. It just inflicts more damage. See? Thunderbolt damage inflicted increased by 100%. Dodge efficiency reduced to 50%. Oh, but stuff is reduced. I don't like that. Uh, nope. Probably not using that ever again. <laughs> but let's go ahead and head up these stairs to the little red marker. Do whatever they're telling me to do. Probably, I think that's Leo over there, but let's see. Can I grab this? Can I grab anything? Like, just random? No. Alright. Let's make our way upstairs then. And, uh, I guess talk to this. I don't know if we should talk to him or just go. No, go inside. There we go. So we're gonna go inside. See what we can't find in here. Find out what's going on. Because they're supposedly stealing stuff from the laboratory. I've heard all of Dandelion's ballads about you. Lambert tells me I'll never be as fast as a real witcher. But I managed to hit him during training today. You beat Lambert? Yeah, we were fencing on the floor pegs when that strange storm came. Lambert looked away. I did a pirouette, hit him right in the gut. Uh, he didn't fall, and then he beat me. You'll make a good swordsman yet. I know. <laughs> Every time Lambert beats me, he says I have potential. Wow, alright, so he thought he was good and then he got beat anyway. Alright, so dodging, double tap stuff, dodges enemies. So let's see if we can't use that while we're fighting. Let's see if I even get a chance to use it. No, it doesn't look like I'm gonna get a chance. Oh, well, that, that was kind of a dodge. Alright, whatever. Obviously, don't use the dodges unnecessarily, only when you 
need to, I guess. I don't, I don't, I don't know. Oh, well, that was cool. Mess with me and die. Sorry about that, I needed the micro fast because I just had like a major sneezing fit. Um, anyway, alright, so let's see where else we gotta go. I wish we could pick up stuff. There's like, this pot. I just, I wanna eat. Alright, whatever, let's just keep going in. So now we have group style? And there it is, group style. Oops, whoops, I got I just messed up everything. Oh, group style does damage to like everybody. Like killing everybody all over the place. Yep, maybe not. Maybe I just suck in the game. I can't even attack people. Oh, they're all dead. Never mind that that really worked out, didn't it? Yeah, right, let's see. Oh, I can open this barrel. Yay, more more cherry beer brewed in Rivia. Oh no, actually, before I had brewed in the capital city of Tamaria, so different. All right, let's just let's just follow this guy. We only got about three minutes left, so as soon as we uh, see what's going on, we'll probably stop. These stairs lead to the lab. Follow me. Man, these guys are... These little bandits are nothing. The energy you annexed from the Circle of Elements is enough to stop the witches? You trembled, yet you complained Savola would have them all, leaving none for you. Did the sight of a single witcher, White Wolf himself, instill fear? The aforementioned considered dead, I might add, is a known killer. I'll gladly challenge him. Leo, stand back. Come on, Professor. Time is essential. I wield the power of the Circle of Elements. They are no threat. Back to work. I want the mutagens ready for teleportation in 15 minutes. Our witches shan't trouble us. We're cut off! The stairs are blocked! The magic barrier looks solid. We need Triss. They're robbing us! Geralt, clear the passage upstairs. Use a sign! A sign? The Ard! I can't do it since I broke my fingers training along the gauntlet. Cast the Ard at the debris. I don't remember the signs. Let's go to the Circle of Elements, a source of the power. You need to try and learn the Ard. Alright. Well, that's great. Let's just go ahead and uh, have a little lesson real fast. While there's mayhem happening. Right next door. Where did Leo even go? Is he is he following me? Am I following him? Where? Oh, there he is. Leo, wait up. A circle of whispering stones. It's an elemental stone. So whispering stones. What is this gonna let me do after I learn it? Success. We'll see in a minute. I knew it would work. Let's get back before Lambert kills the frightener himself. Alright, cool. We have like this little knockback skill thing. I don't want to waste it. I don't know how much I have. We'll have to figure it out as soon as I uh, as soon as I find an enemy. We'll see how much I have. Or what it uses up. But yeah, that that professor guy, he's weird. I thought he was weird, but then that sorcerer, he's even weirder. I don't know. He's weird, really weird. Oh, well that was, that was cool. That was nice. Can I do that to any wall? I want to do that to all walls, because that would just like break down the whole fortress and then kill everybody that's in my way. That would be fantastic. Alright, well... What did you learn? The bandits are in the lab, searching for something. The mage used the circle of elements to create a magic barrier. The plague! You're all children. Why didn't you mention the circle? Triss, child, it didn't seem important. 
If the mage aligned with the circle, he can create a stable portal through which he'll travel to anywhere on the continent, taking your equipment with him. All right, we made a mistake, but you said the mage was harmless. I said I didn't know him. I think we should protect the lab above all. Don't panic, Marigold. We know you'd like to see our witch's secrets. Vesemir, if that idiot doesn't shut it, I'll... Enough! Lambert, stop baiting Triss. Show her some respect. Triss, if we go to the lab, they'll have us surrounded. We know tactics. Maybe we should split up. Geralt's right. We need to protect the lab and kill the Frightener. Who goes where? Only I can break the barrier. I'm going inside. Vesemir? I'll stay and handle the Frightener and Savola. What about you, Geralt? We may both need your help. I gotta choose. Well, we are completely out of time, so you'll have to see what I go with next episode. Uh, because, yeah, that's, that's about all we have right now. But thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it so far. I'm definitely enjoying the game, even though it's from seven years ago. It's a pretty great game, actually, and I definitely can't wait till Witcher 3, but I obviously got to finish the story. So anyway, thanks guys for watching. Please stick around, see some of my other videos. I'll be uploading more of the Witcher gameplay, and uh, that's all there is. So we'll go ahead and pick one of these in the next episode. Thanks guys, and uh, have a great day.